playing your last game with Ryan Denny, and what does that mean to you? Uh, it means everything. You know, I wish you know, time could slow down. Um, you know, it's the last time me and Brian Denny, you know, in front of the fans, so we had, um, excited. You know, I'm not excited that it's an early game, but still, you know, this is home. You know, I'm home good. So hopefully go out there and play great. Levi Hope said that it seems to be a lot of self-scouting, especially with third down between and things. What did you see on the film, and what can be improved and corrected this week? Um, you know, we have a lot of things to improve on, and not just third down. Like, we need to you know, do a better job of executing, you know, like you said, and, you know, playing football to our stand. Levi, that, that was a, a set of circumstances for you guys in that environment. Not a lot of teams are in that football game. What is it about the mental nature of this team that allows you guys to win those types of games? Um, you know, the, 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 the conditioning and the training that Coach Cochran gives us, you know, in the offseason, you know, with the fourth quarter program, um, as well as the summer workouts. Um, you know, we just have that mentality. You know, you know, we, especially going, you know, through last year, you know, we didn't finish the first game, you know, four quarters. Um, you know, that's still at the back of our minds a little bit. So we never want to be in that situation again. You know, we always want to play all the way through 16 minutes or whatever, even after that until overtime. We want to have that mindset and mentality. A couple guys have mentioned the Clemson game. I mean, Ten months later, how much is that still with us? Um, you know, it's a championship game. You know, it just doesn't leave. You know, it's always in the back of my mind. Even this past weekend, you know, it kind of felt like that. You know, Mississippi State's a great place to play in, um, great environment. Uh, the fans were into it. The players were into it. It was a great game. You know, it just felt well. We got back a lot of memories. Is we want to, we want to be able to finish the game. Is that in some ways? I mean, obviously, at the end of the day, you always want to win the championship game. But is that in some ways the silver lining of that loss? Yeah. Guys, find yourself in a situation like that again on Saturday. Like, uh, we've been here, we've got this. No, we, we never, you know, want to have that feeling again. You know, we, we know, you know, a lot of the old guys. We know how, how it feels to win the championship. We know how, how it feels to lose. So, um, just having, you know, even, even Texas A&M, you know, they were scoring in the last drive. You know, kind of brought back old memories. You know, we never want to go back to that. Do you have two a, more? You notice a different spirit of fight in this team coming through all the injuries and everything and kind of culminating in Saturday's um, game or not really? Not, I mean, I feel like we've always had you know, this kind of spirit. You know, it's, it's always the next man up. You know, we want to be prepared um, you know, mentally, physically. Uh, we have a lot of young people or young players that you know, get in the rotation now. And you know, the, the mindset is the same that, that the older guys have. You know? um, this is a team. We want to do our best each and every week, you know, yeah. stay on beating and keep pushing forward and execute. Levi, it's not Last often that you guys are in a position where they have the ball with a chance to either tie or win the game, as was the case. You know, because you're not in that situation often, is a game like this helpful for you for the possibility that you might be in this situation again, you know, as these games get tougher as you move forward? Um, we, you know, we practice situational football um, you know, here at practice. It's nothing new. Uh, you know, we've been in plenty of situations like that, you know, just with our offense. Um, and, you know, it's good preparation, you know, especially playing these tougher teams on the road that we have um, to prepare for. So, you know, having games like that, you know, it, it shows what kind of team we have and um, the drive that we, that we want to keep pushing forward to. Thanks, everyone.